what's going on everyone? RC84 here and like always thanks for watching. Well my friends, I want to be the first to admit that I have been slacking on the channel a little bit here. I haven't been uploading a lot here, uh, putting out new content for you guys. I haven't touched the, the channel's Facebook page in quite a while now and I'm very ashamed of myself. But there's a reason why I have not been uploading a lot. Uh, so here's the thing. Uh, for the last three to four years I've been running by myself. Uh, the RC community used to be really big here in the Wilmington area, which is where I live at, Wilmington, North Carolina. And the RC community used to be humongous. We had two big hobby shops, a lot of race tracks. So every week there was something always going on from racing to drifting, boating, flying, uh, you know, rock crawling. A lot of things were going on and then all of a sudden both of our hobby shops closed down. And then shortly after that all of the race tracks closed down. So after that, it's just like the RC uh, community just completely died off. It, like, it just vanished. Like, everybody that I knew that was in it either got out of or moved away, and I was by myself. And Which, I don't mind being by myself sometimes, you know? That way, if I want to go out and go RCN, just grab one of my, my vehicles, go to wherever I want to go, and just do what I want. But it's also nice to have a group of RCers that you can run with. And that's what I've been doing, my friends. I have actually met some local uh, RC guys right here in my uh, local hometown. Didn't know anything about these guys until they reached out to me on Facebook. Probably, I want to say about a month ago, actually. Uh, they saw me on one of the uh, RC Facebook pages, uh, group pages. And they're like, hey, man, we see that uh, you're into the, the whole RC stuff. You know, Come check us out. So I checked these guys out. One guy named Drew had this humongous crawler course I thought was awesome. Uh, I actually did a couple of videos here on the channel of it. If you have not seen it, I'll include the link down in the description box so you can see that. But awesome course. I love it. And uh, so for the past couple of weeks, I've been hanging out with these guys and just kind of getting to know them and, and, and just hanging out and you know just really, really absorbing that group. Because uh, like I said, last four years I've been running by myself, nobody uh, was into it. None of my friends are into it. They're all into like hunting, fishing, sports, and four-wheeling and stuff like that. And I was like, you know, I like four-wheeling. I like fishing. I'm not a big fan of hunting, all right? I just, I don't know what it is. I don't like, like hunting. <laughs> so, but yeah, so none of my friends ran into it. And then finally I met these guys and uh, the group has been growing a little bit. There's probably maybe eight or nine of us now running, which is awesome. And uh, so I've been kind of absorbing that up a little bit because, you know, just being by myself. And now I have a group uh, of guys that I can hang out with and talk RCs and, and run RCs and stuff. So uh, I've been doing that. Now, I had a few moments where I could break out the camera and film, but I really just wanted to, to run with these guys because I've just, you know, like I said, been by myself. <laughs> All right. So... Um, I really hadn't filmed that much, you know, I did a little bits and pieces with my cell phone, but not with the camera or anything, but I just really wanted to run, and so I didn't want to worry about bringing out, you know, breaking out the camera and stuff like that until I get to know these guys before, you know, I take it out and stuff, but uh, they're really cool with it and everything, so that's awesome. So yeah, so that's what I've been doing here. Uh, another thing, reason why I haven't been uploading as lot is that, um, some days I don't really get out and do any RCing. Uh, you know, I work Monday through Friday, 40 hour job. So when I get home in the afternoon, I'm like just exhausted, tired, um, hot and sweaty and everything like that. And so when I get home, I have like enough energy just to you know, get a shower, eat some dinner and sit back and just chill and watch Netflix and stuff like that. And I know that I had like RC projects to work on and some of my vehicles and stuff. And I was like, I know I got to put out some videos on the channel. But, you know, sometimes I just don't feel like doing it. Um, it's just, you know, the whole setting up, the lighting, the camera, and, and talking about what I'm going to be doing and stuff like that. So, yeah. So, sometimes I just don't feel like it. And sometimes, you know, I like to just go out and run my RCs without breaking out the camera and stuff like that and, and setting up the shot and I had to go home and edit the, you know, the video and stuff like that. So, uh, yeah. And then another practical thing is the weather. It's been kind of crazy here. It's, 
you know, one day it'd be raining, the next day it'd be sunny and hot as crap. And it's been very, very hot here. Uh, it's just like excruciating. Like, I work in the elements every day. I work it out there in the hot, the cold, and everything. And so, you know, and I think anybody who works in the, the it works outside, like doing construction, landscaping, uh, plumbing, and stuff like that. You know, the last thing you want to do is that you want to go back outside. You just kind of want to stay inside the AC, absorb it up, because, you know, eight, nine hours a day out in the sun, eh, you know, kind of like you just want to go home and <laughs> relax in the AC there. So, yeah, so uh, that's one of the factors there is the weather ordeal. So, yeah, so uh, that's reason why I hadn't been posting too much here it's just some days I just I have those days where I just really don't want to do much at all and I think that we all have those days where we really don't want to do anything and just want to relax and stuff and that was me I just wanted to relax and chill and uh, I was like you know I got these projects to build and work on but I just kind of want to have a little bit of me time and stuff like that you know so yeah now um uh, with that being out of the way, now I can move on to the next thing. Uh, the WPL build project. Uh, if you guys remember that, I was doing a project build on the uh, on a uh, 1 16th scale uh, 6x6 uh, military truck from WPL Models or Toys. <laughs> uh, I decided to cancel that build project because I was having so much issues with that build. It was just crazy. Uh, it's just, it was so crazy, and I, I, I got so frustrated with this thing. It's like, you know what? It's not even worth it. It's like a $30 kit that I got off eBay, and then I wanted to, to, to build it and stuff, and, you know, it's just like problem after problem after problem after problem. And I was like, you know what? I'm done with this. It's, it's one of those kits where they make you spend more money in it, and it's like, you know, Thirty dollars, and then I have to spend another fifty or so dollars in parts and electronics and stuff. And I was like, you know, I could take that money, put it towards one of my RCs that I have now, kind of upgrade, or put it towards a a more common vehicle or more hobby grade RC versus a toy grade China knockoff stuff. I mean, the WPL, you know toys or models I like their body shells and you know the bodies or well not body shells but the bodies are pretty detailed and I think they're really awesome but as far as <laughs> building one I wouldn't do it it sucks <laughs> I'm sorry guys I don't really like to get on here and bash uh, other RC companies but when I see one that's just really really terrible I'm like you know, don't go with it it's crap <laughs> I mean, like, the instructions on it were not clear at all. It's just like a picture, and that's it. It really didn't tell you exactly how to do it and stuff like that, where you put it, where you're supposed to put it at. And I was like, you know what, I'm done. I'm tired of, of with it. I spent enough time and enough money on it. I was like, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm tossing this thing to the trash. It's no, it's no good. I'd rather spend that money on one of my Axial SEX-10s or getting a new body shell or saving up for a new RC vehicle, I'd rather do that instead of, you know, trying to build a China knockoff version of, you know, Cross RC, which is really what they're doing. They're taking Cross RC and they're making their own, but in a smaller scale version. But, uh, yeah. <laughs> so, I won't be doing that project build. I actually took the videos down because I just did not want them on the channel just because of that I mean, reason, all right? But uh, other than that, I've been doing great, and uh, I've been RCing a lot, just off the camera, you know, sometimes. You know, like I said, I just like to run them without, you know, even popping out the camera. Just like the other day, I ran the uh, Traxxas in 41. Been a long time since I ran it, but I wanted to run it because I just have not took that boat out, and I hate for it to be sitting up there and <laughs> just looking great. <laughs> Let me show you. It's sitting right up there. There it is. Just sitting up there, and I was like, yeah, I gotta go out. It's a good looking boat. Yeah, so, alright. Ah, uh, that's. Ah, uh, yeah. <laughs> so, yeah, my friend, so that's what's been going on with me. Um, I'm gonna tr try to get back into 
getting these videos out for y'all. I had a few requests come in. People wanted me to do like some how-to videos on how to mount your RC bodies, uh, waterproofing and stuff like that. And I honestly don't do too many how-to videos because there's hundreds of other how-to videos that cover this, you know, that cover that kind of stuff. But uh, a few people has asked me, and I was like, you know, I, you know, if anybody requests something they want me to do or see on the channel, I'll try to do it if I can. <laughs> All right. So, um, but yeah, so that's what's been going on, my friends. So uh, yeah. All right. Well, I took up enough of y'all's time. Thanks for watching, and I will see y'all in uh, the more upcoming videos. So. Like I said, I'm going to get it all, try to get back on track and get these videos out for y'all. My initial goal to put out a video is at least one or two times per week. At least, yeah, one or two times a week I was trying to put out a video. At least, at least if I can get one video done a week, that would be great, you know. So, yeah. <laughs> if I can. It depends on how my schedule is, you know, how the weekend is, you know. It's either I'm doing my photography stuff, which is another one of my hobbies that I do. I'll include the link down in the description box, too, if you want to see some of my phot uh, photography work there. So, yeah. So, yeah. <laughs> That's one of my other things. So, if I'm not RCing, I'm doing photography and, and traveling to different locations and stuff like that to take pictures and stuff. So, and videos as well. But, yeah. All right, my friends. So, thanks for watching, and I will catch y'all in the next coming RC videos. Thanks for watching.